Today on Woot, our host Andrew gets a laugh, Mr. J takes his chest seriously, and Danny and Krista cook up some taco rolls. I'm Andrew. And I'm Rachelle. And this is Woot. Today we learn about healthy snack choices. And Greg reviews a PlayStation 3 at the Sony store. And Misfit High has a dance. But before this, we're going to throw things over to Mr. J, who has a twist on our favorite board game. <laughs> Hello, hey, it's Mr. J, and uh, Cats and Kitties, we got a special game for you, a game that's thousands of years old, and uh, it's the ultimate game of warfare. But of course, it's for all ages, it's for girls and guys, equal playing field. It's called chess, and uh, if you walk around the school playing chess, they'll know you're a super genius, because it takes some brains to play. Uh, first of all, these are pawns, these are, what's that? The, the piece is too small, you, you, want to, you want to, this is my boss talking, you want to dress up to, to explain, I don't want to dress up. Well, gee, someone had a piece of grouchy pie this morning. Okay, I'll dress up as the pawn. Ah, oh, jeez, holy humiliation. Just best I could do on short notice, I'm sorry. So anyway, I'm a pawn, okay? Pawns are just little dinglings. There's eight of them, and they only move one square. They're kind of expendable. Not all that important in the game of chess. Well, they are because they can promote, but that's another story. They're, they're just little goofballs. They're the kind of things that you don't really care about too much. Okay, I'm going to dress up as a, as a rook, a castle. I'll be right back. Oh, that's it. All right, this, I'm supposed to be a rook here. The rooks are, let's see, uh, these little things, they move in a straight line, but they can't move diagonally, only in a straight line. They're, they're kind of used for guerrilla warfare. But up, up. Yeah, I'm here all week. Try the veal. Tip the waitresses. Okay, I'll be back. I am a handsome knight. Get this out of here. Yeah, people walk up to me and they say, hey, why the long face? Oh boy, anyway, yeah, the reason I got the horse head, the knight is like a horse actually, and uh, oh, I'm so happy because I'm the only piece that can actually jump. It jumps in an L shape. So yes, if you need to do some fancy moves, you need a knight. Okay, what's next? Jeez. I am a bishop, as you can obviously tell, a very smart, very intelligent character that only moves diagonally. Again, did I mention how smart I am? Yes, indeed. Yes, the king is here. Of course, uh, I've got a bit of a gut, and that's because, well, the king is lazy. He's actually the ruler, but he's the laziest piece. He only moves one at a time. He doesn't do hardly nothing. The real star of the game of chess is, I'm not, I don't want to dress up as her. Don't make me dress as a queen. Oh, geez. All right, all right. I dress under duress. The queen is actually the most powerful piece in the game. She can do anything, move in any direction. She's your main piece. So, ladies and gentlemen, cats and kitties, make sure you ask for a chess club at your school because it's a game that ain't for no sissies. Girls, it'll improve your mind, and guys, it'll make a man out of you. That Mr. J, he sure has a unique way about him. <laughs> 